let me simply add that it's my very good honor to meet you and you may call me... Welcome back guys, this is episode 5 of my Pokemon Amateurs adventure. And you see I'm right here in front of Koga's gym. We left off last time uh, defeating Erika with my newly assembled full team. As you can see right here, I've trained them up just a little bit more since then. They are on the same levels, 36, 37, which is where I like it. Which is find I find it kind of interesting because I've never actually had this before. Most of the time I find I have you know one Pokemon that's my favorite that I've been using a lot. That is just uh, quite a few levels uh, higher than all my other Pokemon. So um, it's kind of fun just to have all these different ones that I haven't really used before, them, except for obviously Vengeful. I've used Haunter and Gengar before. He's just my favorite Pokemon, so I wanted to include him. Um, but all the other ones I haven't ever used before. Um, so it's, it's interesting kind of playing around with them, you know, getting a feel for what they're good in, what they're not going to do, how I can like tweak them a little bit, um, and, and where I, you know, might not want to use them, but I can still get away with it. Um, so yeah. So it's, it's, it's been pretty fun. I've been really enjoying this playthrough. So let's go in. We're going to go ahead and uh, try to defeat Koga, which I think will be pretty pretty easy. I mean, I only have one Pokemon with Psychic Attacks right now. Um, so, I mean, he is all poison. I just rip right through him. That's like my last resort. I'm going to try and do it without using him the whole time, though. Um, but, you know, we'll see. Uh, ninja Sneak Attack. Yeah, so I'm leading with Ventral with my Haunter. He's really fast, he's got Hypnosis. That's about it. Uh, he's one level away from learning Dream Eater, which is upsetting because that would really help here, but I didn't want to train him up a level. I know, that's really pathetic, but I figured I'd get my levels here and then we'll go face Sabrina right after. Damn. Sweet. There we go, all right. Oh, X attack, though. It's interesting how they're starting to use all the items and everything as you're going through. Um, we're just going to hit with Nightshade a bunch of times. I mean, pff, that's all I got. Of course he woke up. That's all right. Yep, didn't think so. And then Nightshade just... Because I can. I could have done Lick, I got the PP for it, and he was close enough, but it's whatever. Oh, hey, look at that, 38. Wouldn't have taken much training, so that's awesome. Hell yeah, Dream Eater. Um, oh, this is actually difficult, because I kind of like Lick against other ghost types, but I can find a way around. Confuse Ray is just awesome. So, we're gonna get rid of Lick. It's really like the only ghost type attack. Dream Meter should honestly be a, a ghost type attack, but in my mind, you know. Um, Muck? Nah, for Muck we'll bust out big business. This is interesting because big business, big business is pretty slow. Um, so we're gonna try and sleep him. And then, I, don't, I think it's gonna take more than one attack for Eh, poison, who cares? For the psychic to to really knock him out. Yeah, and it just did a little under half. Which was fine. Hit him again. Then I'll swap big business out for wheezing as well. Take care of uh, coughing with someone else. Um, ch -ch -ch -ch. Percy's could use some training. Coughing's not a big deal. Percy's is like the weakest move set of all my Pokemon right now. Um, just you know, nothing that I really want him to end with. Oh, and I got poisoned. That's okay. This is about to be over. Yeah. Not really a challenge, honestly. Uh, yeah, we'll go back. Needs a little training anyway. Yeah. 
43, though. Damn. That is unfortunate. Yeah, and that was what I was afraid of, is that was the exact thing was going to happen. But that's okay. I got plenty of options. Um, I just use Ventral. I could use Starmie. Not really that useful, though. Um, Torture doesn't have much to him right now. Not in this scenario. You know, special defense is pretty good on Chansey. That's alright. Not quite half. Oh, and poisons. So I'm going to do another sword stance to buff him up, but either way, it's probably going to take two turns. Oh, or three. Come on, Omega. What are you doing? I can't remember if Earthquake affects wheezing in this game or not. I think it does. Dang. Oh, we gotta end it. No time to chance it. There we go. Yeah. I mean, not the smoothest I've ever done. I've beaten Koga, but eh. It's alright. Got through it regardless. Let's get out of here. We will go heal up. And then we're gonna go face Sabrina, who should be a, a little more difficult than Koga, simply because it's all psychic Pokemon, except for her Venonat, I believe she has one in this game, so. Um, it'll be okay though. We'll just kind of beef our way through it. I'm probably gonna stick with Mew most of the time. <laughs> Definitely not Haunter with his weakness to psychics. Alright, so we made it. I've already cleared this place out, just like I did with Koga's. And, um, I think I remember how to get there. Nope, already lost. I had it down earlier. Totally had it down earlier. Alright. Maybe down here? Maybe down here? No. No. I'm just choosing randomly now. Oh, here, and I'm back at you again. Okay. It's up, right, and then over, and then maybe over. No. Totally lost. Welcome to the next 25 minutes. While I try and figure out where to go. Back at this fucker again? God damn it! It's a challenging part of this game. I refuse to be beaten. Oh, this is bullshit. I'm back here again. What's up, dude? Okay, okay, I can figure this out. Okay, that wasn't it. Okay. Ah, the pressure. I made it. All right. Save. I'm not sure who she starts with, but I've got Percy starting. It's probably not a good idea in case she starts with... No, because she's just all psychic. So... Doesn't have any ghost type. Uh, okay, yep. Ben Spoon, such a stereotype. Uh, go back to the Matrix. This is honestly the gym leader I had the most trouble with. I think probably everyone does. Um, simply because she's just the psychic type is so overpowered in this game. Yeah, Cadaver doesn't have very good defense. <laughs> Special defense, yes. Regular defense, not so much. And you're done. Yes, alright, cool. Good start. Good start. 
Mr. Mime, solely psychic, also bad defense. Probably gonna change to. Hmm. You know, I'm gonna wear him out. I'm gonna wear Percy's out. Um. Oh, yeah, oh, never mind. Not good defense. Or not. Pretty decent defense, excuse me. Um. Fuck it, let's just, just wear him out. I don't care about experience right now. They're so close. Oh, shit. Oh, that was your mistake. Oh, that was awesome. Alright. Damn good job. Venom off. Yeah, easily switch out. Um, what is that? Bug poison? Bug psychic type, I think? Try torture. And... Ice Beam. Oh, of course. It's sort of a tank right now, which is what I want. Oh, sweet. Critical hit, right when you need it. Yeah, I'll take it. That's fantastic. And then Alakazam, which I'm just gonna go straight up Mew. <laughs> Fuck it. Alakazam sucks. Oh, why? Oh, come on, it's not fun when you're stupid. <laughs> Doing it again. Why did I get to go twice? That's weird. Holy shit, that was awesome. One hit KO. Fucking badass. You see that, Colin? That's what's gonna happen. Up to level 70. Yeah, because I'm even close to that. I'm just over halfway. What team do I get from her? I actually forget. Psy wave. Oh, yeah. That could be useful. Not bad. So now, I can surf down to Cinnabar. I've got quite a few things I want to do around there. Um, and on the way, I'll do some training and everything. So that's really what I'm looking for. i got to find my way out of here. Hold on. We are not out of the woods yet. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, wait. Hold on. This looks familiar. This looks familiar. This looks familiar. <gasps> we made it. Oh, oh Jesus, alright, that dungeon is done. So, no, we're gonna go to Cinnabar Island, and that's where I'll pick up my next episode. Um, hopefully I'll have done quite a bit since then, and add really, now I'm starting to get to this time where I can uh, um, uh, put my uh, mo my movesets that I want in, the po in my Pokemon, right? So, i um, starting to get rid of the moves that I don't want. And hopefully I'll be able to do some evolutions coming up here somewhat soon. Um, I mean, well, evolu evolution. Um, you know, I just need to get past those thresholds. I, I definitely did it with Dreamier. Now, anytime I'm ready, um, I can trade him up to Gengar. I'm happy about that. Um, but that one might be for a little while. So, hope you guys are enjoying this, you know, little mini episode series thing I'm putting on for you guys. It's, it's a blast for me, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take it easy.